Hi guys, it's Julia again and today we are going to learn another song from the game Zelda and as you guys know I'm a little bit addicted, I feel a little bit uh, guilty of playing too much Zelda but at least I'm making really cool beginner tutorials for you guys so I created a little bit of a simpler version of this song because sometimes it gets very high I hope you enjoy this version and let's dive right into learning the song together this song starts on the first finger on the A string and this is a normal first finger. And then we will play one, three, and then we let go of both of the fingers and play an open A string. Then we play three. We just switch our bow to the D string by making a, a very small upward motion with our right arm. And then we are on the D string. And we play the third finger on the D string. Directly we make this small motion back to the A string. And play an A. And then we play again. One, three, zero. Like in the beginning. One, three, zero. So now that this was the first part. We have... And then we go on. We will play one, three again. So we will play one, three. And then we play the three on the E string and play three, two. Then we move back to the A string, three. And it makes sense to put all your fingers on the A string directly because after the three, we will play two, one really quickly. Two, one, zero. So play, play three, three, put all the fingers on the string. So you will be able to play the fingers faster. So all together we will get the first part which goes like this. And then we will go on with another part. Um, the second time you will get at this part, you will play another last part instead. You will play a long three. just play a very long three and for the long three make sure to start on the beginning of the bow so make sure that with this note you move all the way back to the beginning of the bow so you will have a lot of bow to play the long note and I'm sorry for shaking my hand a little bit um, so try to bow straight so it doesn't get shaky and also just listen to the music to see at which part you have to play the long note and at some point you have to play so the first time you play and the second time you play in the end of the first sequence the, then there's this other part that goes like and I'm going to teach you how to play that now wait a second Okay, so we start with the third finger on the A string and we again put all our fingers on the string because we are going to play two and one after that. So we will get three, two, one, two, one. And then we play the three on the D string. And this is quite a tricky change. So we get... And this can be quite hard if you are a beginner. So make sure to just practice it really often, please. Really take this part out and practice it until you're able to play. And yes, this can take a while, but yeah, that's why you learned the violin in the first place. You knew you had to practice, so yeah, you can practice this. And then we will get, after that part, two, and we also place the first finger on the string. And then we go to the one. Two, one, zero, one, zero, one. And 
And then we will get back to three and we play the same part as before. Three, two, one, two, one, three. But this time we go on with a two on the A string. And then we go on with a two on the E string. And to play those two twos, you could either just change the string of the two or to roll your finger to the side. I, in this case, I would say just change string because the song is not that fast. And then we will get And if you want to end the song, you can play uh, uh, Sorry, this was a low second, so instead of It is And then the 2 is low too So once I will play the whole last part so you can see it all together song uh, tell this lullaby I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and yeah before I quit I will play it once more so you can see the whole song all together and I will play it uh, a bit quicker this time song i really hope you enjoyed this tutorial i wish you good luck learning this song and see you back another time <laughs>